Diesel are the best action RPG that are playable for mid-range spawns. Surely, we always try to give the best gameplay as well as the graphic in the ones, so my subscriber will be happy to pick the best game as your daily game. Remember to like this video and please enjoy the video of Top 10 Best RPG for Mid-Range Spawn on Play Store and App Store Smooth Gameplay English Version Ragnarok 20 Ragnarok 20 Heroes NFT This game has less than 1GB and you already have a great action hack and slash game and playable freely because we can play the whole stage in auto when we tap the auto button. All of the skill and attack will do it automatically. I think this is a good option for us. In fact, we cannot lock the target as we desire by using our skill. The skill will aim the target within the nearest range. It has a dungeon base game where we can explore the village and inspect the other player's equipment to see how good their quality or grade is. While in the village, we also can capture the pet freely. Mostly they will stand still in one spot and we can easily tap the capture icon to make them our alliance. Increase your equipment and get various weapons or armor through daily dungeons. At the end, you can trade the token by using the NFT features which is a new play to earn a game or RPG. Ragnarok 20 Heroes NFT is the best ARPG game Android and iOS. Infinite Arcana Infinite Arcana. This game is one of the best roguelike games on mobile. The graphics are crafted beautifully, even it has a bird view or top-down perspective, but it's pretty much matched with the gameplay. Because by this visual, we can see a wider enemy's location. In fact, the number of the enemies coming on us is really massive. Mostly, it's more than 4 enemies with a male and long-range playstyle. This game has a stamina based game where the stamina will recharge when we stand still and do nothing once we use the dash action that it will be used. The dash button is the most crucial action we should keep and unleash it when to face the boss. The boss will unleash consecutive attack from a distance with a wider area of effect range. Remember to cast your ultimate skill when it reaches 100% in a certain spot. We'll find the market to buy some items there, but also each time we pass through the stage, then we'll have an option to select a different new ability. Infinite Arcana is the best action hack and slash game for mobile. Fairy Tale Fairy Tale Fierce Fight, one of the best ported games on mobile from the anime. Seriously, it has 100% similar character creations, design, and how well the voiceover is. Even the skill showcase is pretty good in action. This game represents three main characters of Natsu, Lucy, and Grey. So in combat, we'll play within three parties that we can be switched anytime. It will boost our winning chance to become higher because every time we change the hero, then the cooldown of each hero will recharge in auto. So, the best strategy is we always keep switching the hero and waiting for the other skills hero is ready, so we'll not have any hard time to face a massive number of the enemies at once. It's a collectibles hero game base where we can obtain them through gacha, the higher of the star hero grade will represent more powerful characters. Even though we can get the common hero through storyline, I think that's not enough to clear the higher stage level. But for me, Fairy Tail Fierce Fight has a great animation and really affordable game ARPG for Android and iOS to play for mid range spawns. Sword Dash Sword Dash, this game is ready for release globally, but I don't know exactly why the developer always showed the beta word on the Play Store. Everything is completely perfect from the gameplay and how the feature it has. When you have collected some rewards, we can get a costume or skin. It will give the character buff power and add some status point. With a great look that I think it's pretty worthy. The combat mechanism of Sword Dash is purely a hack and slash game with a high level difficulty, making the player frustrated when we reach a higher level. I need a lot of effort on upgrading the equipment through ascending weapons. Sword is the main primary weapon we can use but in combat, we also can get the other extra weapon as a supporting abilities like flying sword that combine with a burning effect. But this ability will be available to get after we clear a specific area. There is no single story we found since we started the game, but surely this is the best hack and slash game mobile. Metria Metria, Asobimo is the best gaming company on mobile who is not looking for a player cast as their priority. A gaming experience is the goal they are looking for that makes the player always stay loyal on playing this game. 
After making a great game of Toram Online, finally the developer made an action RPG game that has a beautiful panorama and amazing looks of landscape, so greeny with a beautiful crystal clear water. Unfortunately, we cannot swim in it, but we can go fishing. What a great experience to play. The gameplay of Metria is we'll play with three main characters. We can switch them up every time and unleash their skill once we recharge their stamina into 100%. There are some tools available to use to gather some material or ingredients. Once we keep using it to zero, then the tools will be broken. The combat mechanism is really satisfying to play. It has 360 degrees view rotation. So we can see the whole action freely. This is the best action RPG high graphic game in Android and iOS. Naruto Ultimate Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm Finally, the official game Naruto coming up on mobile with a perfect gameplay and what all Naruto fans are looking for. So it has an open world concept where we can find the secret or hidden treasure around the village. I really love how alive the game looks, with so many NPCs walking around randomly. We can interact and make a dialogue with a certain NPC and see the scenes when we follow the mission. The combat mechanism is an action game in one versus one. The camera angle is really Really dynamic, it makes the player perspective become more interesting. The hero will have some skill that's available to unleash with an exactly the same skill visual as the anime we know in the movie. So, the game has a similar storyline which makes us feel so nostalgic, even it has a premium price on Play Store, but I think it's really worth to play with so much features and great animation game, it has as the best action hack and slash game RPG for mobile. Chronicles of Infinity Chronicles of Infinity this game I think has been forgotten by the players. I think it's because the developer are not thinking of the player wish. For example, they keep releasing a new server even if it reach server 300. From the server number, we have seen their goal is looking for the player cast and keep grabbing it and releasing the new server. This kind of game we should understand and know for playing a good game for our daily game. But overall, I really love the game's graphic. In combat, it has so much flashy skill with a different color based on the hero we are selected for. I don't have any interest in the storyline because we can tap the auto quest since we play it. In the early game, it's quite easy to beat the boss only need two single skill to strike the boss into the abyss. This game should be a great example for the other game's developer to keep the server number smaller in total. Hades Mobile Hades Mobile, we are so lucky to have a PS5 games on mobile with such a similar gaming experience. Even if it is only available to play by becoming a Netflix member, but I'm sure the game will give you a great gameplay. The art style is really good, seriously it has its own visual that we will never see in any game on mobile. It's so colorful with deep and dark fantasy vibes. The gameplay of Hades Mobile is a hack and slash action game, but we will play in a roguelike base. So, we can get multiple abilities after reaching or clearing certain stage. The combat mechanism seems so fast, it has a dynamic speed that makes the player have a high concentration and focus to avoid the incoming attack. This game has a god mythology that comes from great regions as the main storyline. This is the best action RPG game for mobile. Metro Beast Metro Beast Action Roguelite This game is really good in graphic, but I am sure many of you all don't know if it exists on the Play Store now. What a hidden game that everyone should try even if the game's features is super limited. We only can do a few things to upgrade the character's power by enhancing the weapon and switching the equipment. The rest, we should improve our power by getting random abilities with a different elements of power of ice, fire, and lightning. This all can be adjusted based on the ability we are selected. In one stage, we need to pass through over 15 waves. Each of the waves will be guarded by some monster. In a certain spot, the market will be available to get some weapons in a rare quality grade. But don't worry because I am sure each of the waves will only taking a short period of time to clear it at all. Overall, it need more updates about the features like PvP or Daily Dungeon. Hopefully, the developer will keep making those things to attract more newbies player. Surprisingly, the game size is way too small. We only need to download less than 200 megabytes to play it. Mia 
Mia, surely there is so many things to develop about this game. It only has a few things we can do especially while we are at the lobby. There are two features available to pick, which are a costume and also can raise up the status hero. But it will cause some in-game gold that we can collect after clearing the stage. It has a roguelike game, to get some new ability or improve the ability will increase our power significantly. The combat arena is quite monotone, so we need more area and brighter visual to make our eyes feel so more spoiled and enjoying seeing in a longer time. So the gameplay is, we can freely block the attack perfectly from any directions. We don't even need to spot the monster to prevent the attack. Dash action is really important to reach the long range enemy and kill him as our priority. This game has a realistic 3D visual with a nice looks of sci-fi concept. Mia, I'm waiting for more stories and more features to complete this amazing hack and slash game for mobile. Phantom Blade Executioners Bonus, Phantom Blade Executioners. There are tons of reasons why you should play this game. It has a beautiful art style even it looks like a hand drawing which is handmade. The combat mechanism is really good. Seriously, you must learn and remember the combo pattern. There is more than one button should we combine to create a better combo. Luckily, we can tap the auto combo to unleash the combo even easier. Block action, dash action, and even jumping to make a grappling on the air by using your sword will satisfy your gaming experience. Always try to improve your hero strength by focusing on the equipment, skill, and items. The whole background has a dark fantasy theme with a darker visual entirely. These are all the best RPG games in English that we can play on mobile now and has globally released. Get these games on Play Store and App Store straight away. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to give a like and comment or request for my next content. See you on the next video. Thanks.